party store to see if they have any superhero balloons because we're going to have a tag sale and we also need to stop at the dollar store to get some signs. Alice, have you ever been to a party store before? No. Oh, well this will be an exciting experience for you. Okay. Well, Superman got his powers because Superman is from Krypton, which is a planet far, far away. Okay. And when he came to Earth, because Earth has a yellow sun, he got all kinds of superpowers that he can fly and run fast, and he has super breath, and he has x-ray vision and heat vision, and all kinds of stuff. We actually just watched the first two Superman movies, didn't we? Those movies are a little weird because they have other powers in there that Superman didn't have in the comics. Yeah. Like, do you remember when Superman was falling out of the window and then all of a sudden his clothes just turned into his Superman costume? Yeah. Like, that's not really a power unless it was just him doing something really fast. But then also, remember when he throws the S off of his chest and it turns into like a big piece of uh, plastic? Remember that? That's not a superpower in the comics either. But sometimes, remember, like we were saying with Spider-Man, sometimes in the movies they just change things. Yeah. What's your favorite movie that we've seen with the superhero? Superman. The first one with just Lex Luthor or the second one with Zod? The first one. The first one? There's the dollar store. I'm pretty sure the party store is around here somewhere. I, I just saw the Butterfinger store. Alice calls the dollar store the Butterfinger store because we bought Butterfingers there once. Yes. Do you like Butterfingers? Yes. You know, when I was a kid, the spokesman for Butterfingers was the Simpsons. But it seems like I haven't seen a Simpsons Butterfinger commercial in a long time. Do you like The Simpsons? Yes. You know, they have a comic too. Yeah. And they even have a superhero in their comics. Well, they have a superhero on the show who has his own comic, and his name's Radioactive Man. And he kind of looks like Dr. Solar, who I was just showing you yesterday. Here's a little party store we found called Party Plus. Do you think this will be any good? Yes. Look up there. Look at these chairs. Wouldn't you like this princess chair at our house? Uh, yes. Look how nice they are. There's like a queen one and a king one. But this has a blanket on it. Well, this is a kind of small party store. There are bigger ones than this. But I think they do have superhero balloons. Necklaces. Necklaces, huh? Do you like them? Yes. Look, they have fake money, too. And fake money sacks. Do you want a necklace? Yes. Oh, they have this. Oh, this is hairspray. I thought maybe that was silly string. Which necklace do you want? One. The gold one? Yes. Okay, so we are leaving Party Plus because the guy there was just totally ignoring us. Okay. We were trying to buy some balloons. We were standing in the checkout with the balloons and the necklace Alice wanted, but the guy just was talking to other customers and ignoring us for like five minutes. So we have other things to do, don't we, Alice? Yes. We can't just sit there at this little tiny party store waiting to somebody talk to us so let's try to find a different party store I think there's a couple more on this road well there's a dollar store here they may have they may have superhero balloons at the dollar store so let's let's try here yes and I hope I have a princess one you hope they have a princess balloon too yes okay we can try to find that also and maybe they have butterfingers found a baby. You like that one? Mm -hmm. And then look, 
Butterfingers. I got these, right? So this will forever be known as the Butterfinger store. Yes. So now we are going to Party City, the third store that we're going to today. Okay. Because Dollar General did not have any Spider-Man balloons. <laughs> so this is obviously a much bigger store. <laughs> don't typically like corporate chains, but I gotta say they have a lot more options here than the last place. Look at that nice carpet. <laughs> What's that, Alice? What are these a balloons? Peppa Pig knocker. There's all kinds of Peppa Pig stuff. Look at this giant one. Look at that giant Peppa Pig. Peppa. Is that crazy? Yes. Do you want that one? Yes. A life size Peppa Pig? Look, they have an Elmo, too. This one. What one? This one. You gotta tell Mommy, because you want a, a baby shark fourth birthday, right? Yes. You gotta tell her all the stuff is right here. Between the Barbie and the Descendants. Oh, and look, here's some superhero stuff. Perfect. This is what we want. Even Baby Yoda. Right here. Are these all? I found the baby Yoda plates and napkins. Oh yeah, look at all those. Yeah, pinatas. I just want like these big balloons. We got Captain America. The whole. Do I have any like? Oh, they have these Batman balloons. Look at this Batman mask. That's cool. Maybe Daddy, <laughs> you tell Mommy to have uh, to throw a superhero party for Daddy. Yes. Look, they even have capes, Alice. Capes. Yeah. They have a Superman cape and a Batman cape. I said more balloons. More balloons? And these things are huge, right? Yeah. I guess those ones are huge. Yeah. I think that should be good. Wow, Spider Man knocker. They're gonna love us up front when all this stuff inflated. Yeah. And look, all the princesses. Are you sure you don't want like a Disney princess birthday instead of a baby shark birthday? Baby <laughs> you want a birthday party themed around a song. Oh look, and they have Elsa stuff, but you already had an Elsa birthday when you were one, I think, or two. Okay, come on. Paw Patrol. So is that your new friend? Do we have a nice day today? Yes. <laughs> Say bye bye to everybody. Bye bye.